So do you yeah. think that the 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 industry as a whole right, is moving uh, more and more towards this kind of tailored, you know, uh, insurance structure? That means in the past probably it's very flat, right? Everyone pays similar rates, you know, yeah, and then sure. now it's it's moving more and more towards this kind of direction. Do, what do you yeah. feel about it? Do you think it's better than before, or or, or what do you feel? Yeah. Okay. For me, is I feel that it's definitely better than before. Being a consumer myself, right? Uh, like uh, for my own car, I actually bought a new extension that has been released by some of the players in the market. Uh, it's called Waiver of Betterment. Uh, if your car is more more than five years old, okay, if you bring it back to the authorized uh, brand workshop, for example, right, you may need to pay up to. F- 10 to 15% for new spare parts if you met an accident, despite it's your fault or not. Uh, I can bring up the chart now and see just to just to share with you guys. That'd be cool. Show us. Yeah. Yep. Okay, it's up. Yeah. So if your car is below five years old, that you will need to you don't need to pay anything to replace new parts. But if your car is five years and above, then uh, let's just say you met an accident, okay? Your fault or not your fault, okay? Either party, okay? And your your repair bill comes up to be 10,000 ringgit, okay? If your car is five years old, you will need to bear 1,500 ringgit to, to replace new spare parts for your car. Uh, and the rate will continue to increase as your car ages. Uh, so... Like um, there is, there are a few companies that have have this new extension. You need to pay up to hundred to two hundred ringgit a year to buy back this 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 uh extra fees that you have to pay if you meet 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 an accident. No? Mm. Mm. So essentially, is instead of paying the extra fifteen percent. In, in a case of going into insurance, you pay an extra 100 to mitigate this extra cost. Yes. Something like that, month on month. Okay, okay. Yeah. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah. Mm. So is... Come again, sorry. 100 to 200 ringgit extra per year. Yeah. Okay. okay. Oh, so just 100 to 200 extra per year, not a per month. Ah, okay, okay. Oh, per month, that's, that's, that's expensive. <laughs> Yeah, sorry guys, I don't own a car, so <laughs> trying to engage uh, in a conversation. <laughs> <laughs> but okay, that's cool. So, do you see average people paying more because of all these or paying less as a result of uh, this kind of more tailored uh, premium structures? I guess essentially is uh, what you want uh, or what, what do you want because there are, there are a lot of people, their car is actually just to, to go to work and go back from work. So they may just need a, the most conventional, most basic coverage. But for people who, who drive a lot of outstation, tra- travels a lot, you know, uh, then they may want this kind of thing because they have the high tendency of, of car accident because they are always on the road. But there are a lot of people that say, hey, my, I insured my windscreen for the past 10 years. Uh, I never could now before. So, yeah, then it's fine. Uh, you don't have to buy it this year. Uh. Mm. I think uh, very tough to kena windscreen if you are in KL, right? The road so slow, so jam. Uh, how to get hit by anything? All right. Yeah, yeah, right. But, okay, okay. That's cool. Interesting. But there are some people who are always on the highway. Yes. I have one to change every year. Because oh. every time I look at that, uh, oh, damn. Yeah, okay. yeah. Cool. So, interesting. Yeah, that's the thing. So it really depends on what you want. Uh. Like some people say, I live in a flood prone zone. You know, and actually that partial partial flood cover for free, yeah, uh, ten per ten percent or twenty percent is applicable to me. You know, I don't have to pay anything extra. But I know that my house area is a flood prone zone. Then I better buy. Uh, oh. or damage of falling tree. Actually, this one, I do see a lot of it happening nowadays. So, if actually you didn't extend to to buy the damage of falling tree, which is called the special perils, uh, 
okay. uh, you may not be covered as no you, you're not covered yeah but some companies actually do extend the damage of falling damage of falling tree for free hey this is cs for more money malaysia we are a platform dedicated to helping malaysians like you make smart financial decisions um, and the way we do that is through providing you with actionable advice such as the video you just saw right and but we're not here just to become your uh, intellectual entertainment we really do want to see you succeed and um, because we want to see you live that ultimate life that you've always dreamt of right and in order for us to do that what we've decided to do is we want to help um, make it easier for you by providing different types of rewards throughout the months so make sure you check out the description below click on that link and see what type of reward you might be able to qualify for by taking action right now and if you have any other questions about any of this feel free to contact us wherever you find us take care